We gotta stop the marriage. Crashing a wedding is one of my favorite tropes in the media. And oh man, this is gonna be good. The vice captain who got demoted. I'm not sure if he's still, you know, in the same status. I don't know why he's getting rewarded with this, but it's because he's part of, you know, noble families. Now, there is clash between, you know, the like steward's side and the vice captain's side, like Arbor versus fucking no huge, huge not. Ryo is here. Ryo has, you know, our spirit too. And like our power should be enough to just crash the wedding, save the girl and leave. What's the game plan? Just crash it? Take city and fly out of here? Let's begin today's reaction. When? So Proxy Empire crushing defeat by it. When did this happen? In the last conflict. When was that though? Proxy Empire, that's what race is from. That's why they're kind of clouded. Okay. Oh, I didn't realize that Christina, Flora, Stewart, they were all Huguenot. I thought only Stewart and this piece of shit on the right who also looks like Charles is Huguenot. And this is like the royal family. What the fuck? Yeah. OP truth attack. Crash it. Take Seria to fly out of here. Spirit farm is so OP. Yep, she knows everything that we do. <laughs> What's she gonna say? Is she gonna show up? Be like, who are you? I am Rio's partner, <laughs> soulmate. How's she, how's she gonna explain this? And then she steadily seems like, what the fuck? Rio has been ghosting me, he sent another woman for me. Silver Bride, Seria. すまないね、セリア。これまでなかなか顔を出せなくて、結局仕方ありません。お父様も公務で。よ、that does this make their them look good? And here's the funniest part. Arbor family. Basically, they're respected right now because the proxy empire fucked this kingdom up so hard. Arbor family, they barely managed peace negotiations. And then now, you're using that clout, which is pretty much the coward way out, which, you know, peace is important, but like you didn't even win. You barely fucking just submissioned. And then you think that a marriage with Sedia's family is somehow going to bolster the kingdom of Beltra? Because. Two important noble families are now united. This suddenly imp improves morale? Flag. Security will not be flawless. Spirit form, easy. Blackmail. Ooh. Okay. So dad might be opposed to this shit. He's just kind of making the best out of the situation. But they are in contact with the royal family. But that term betrayed this kingdom again. What is this kingdom representing? Is it the Arbor family or is it the Huguenot? And I still don't even know if Flora, Christine, and the royal king and queen, are they Huguenots? I'm assuming they are right now because, yeah, Duke Huguenot is Stuart's family. But that picture we saw before literally showed the entire Flora, Christina, king, along with Stuart and Stuart's shitty whatever blonde guy. I thought the Stuart and the shitty blonde guy, those are Huguenot. I thought the royal family is not Huguenot, but the picture showed me, so I'm supposed to assume that they are. Ugh. 
大変ありがたいと思っている。我がアルボー公爵家の指揮監督のもとに活躍していただきます。This piece of shit, bro. It is. He's disrespecting you in your own house in front of your daughter, bro. Elda. Can't even fucking save Seria. Was gone for the entire time, bro. I don't care if he has good intentions, bro. He's getting fucking. Just, just getting walked across in front of his own daughter in his own house at the fucking dinner table, bro. Shoot, you stop. He better do something to clutch. So, s t e c o c o n i r u s i s h i m p u n o t a n i t a s h i m a s s h e r u s a m a Otosama Tomodomo, s h o j i t a s h i m a s n o e k o t i r Me too, actually. The wedding crash is gonna be good. Yapari Kenjuna Kabidona Asni Sonai de Ruka Haruto Bashoa Shirono Soto. This kingdom sucks. We should just burn down this kingdom, bro. We should. <laughs> the proxy empire should have just ended this kingdom. I'm sure the proxy sucks too, but like, yo, this kingdom sucks. Everything about it is rotten. Just like, is there anyone good here other than Sedia? What, what, what's good about this place? <laughs> the letter, the first letter we sent, and then no one. No more letters after that first one. Yo, where's she at? Where's Aisha? You're gonna burn it? Aisha, right now. Rio! You're here! He did! Four years of ghosting after that first letter. Let's fly out of here. Yeah, you haven't. How? She's been stunted since 12 years old. I'm not having this. Yeah, we got a lot of bitches too now. Wait till you see the other girls. Oh, 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 Kind of. The wilderness. The pasta place. The tea she used to always make for us. Boom! No. Yeah, he tortured us. And then we beat his ass. I think she's like 21 right now, right? There's always been like a five year gap or something. She, she's in her 20s, actually. So, like, thank God this place of age isn't like 14, bro. One second. Actual difficulty. You don't mean that. There's no way. She, she, she must be saying this to like calm Rio, because there's no way you mean this shit. No way you believe that. Yes. Yes. We should take her and drop her off at the forest and leave her. Leave her with Latifa. なんて。ごめんなさい。リオ、もう行きなさい。ダメよ。そろそろ世話役の色々準備があるの。好きな前にあなたと会えてよかったわ。あきちゃん。We're crashing that. That ain't happening. 
God, she's so tiny, bro. Huh. Why is she holding back? Because she's too kind. Because, like, we know that obviously we can just take her. But to her, it's like a burden she doesn't want to place on Rio. Okay. That's frustrating. But we're going to take her. There's no way we just let this shit happen. Bye bye? No bye bye. Hi hi. Take her. I think she just wants to help. Next day, here we go. Day of the wedding. Wait, 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 wait. Race? That makes a lot more sense. Because Arbor family, the peace negotiation. He was the ambassador from Proxy you know, Empire from the beginning too. He also was you know, around Floro during the kidnapping. But he convinced. It's not as if, like, Charles did it himself. No, 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 no. He's been, just been puppeteered by race the entire time. よくぞいらしてくださった。我々の中ではありませんか。喜んで出席。<laughs> What a convenient excuse. Ooh. Oh, he's just yapping. Charles didn't even know about like what that fucking meant about the first night together. Anyways, uh oh, uh oh, spirit, spirit around. It's us. He just yapping still. I'm sure he detected Aisha. Oh, looks great, but unfortunately, wasted on Charles. Dude, this is some re zero shit. With the whole regular wedding right now. Oh my god. The fact that Seria already subjected herself, herself as like a doll. This is actually some regular shit. Multiple wives just treating them as just dolls and objects. Like six of them? Five, six of them? Are the wives mean? Oh shit, it's the first one. This this is the main white, bro. She's gonna be so elitist and gatekeep. Actually, I don't even wanna be here. Don't get cocky, bitch. I'm the main one. These are peasants, bro? Not peasants, but lower status. How can I smile when you're talking like this? Christina showed up? But like, again, I have... What? Christina and Flora, are they huge nuts or not? 1541 we're at. There was a fucking frame where we were talking about the different factions, right? Where was it? At this point, are they Huguenots or not? What is this fucking frame? Why are they making this so weird? Look at this shit. They fled the royal capital. Princess, also, they all fled the royal capital. They're all Huguenots. Right? Right? H how does this shit work? I don't fucking know. All right, let's get back to it. I think we were around here. <laughs> but the fact that Christina can show up like this unprovoked 
must mean that Stuart and them, the actual like Huguenots who are beefing, because they fled. And they even asked, like, are you still in contact with the Huguenots at the dinner table? And they said, I will not take such slander. Why would Christina be able to show up? Because even though they're kind of all family, it's like they're the Beltran family. <laughs> this is so fucking stupid. Why would they have that frame with the royal family and Stuart and them together? They're the Beltram, royal Beltram, Beltram and Huguenot. This is so. That scene was so fucking stupid. Christina seems to have matured more. She's actually smiling rather than just being a bitch. Okay. <laughs> look at the look at the wife over there. Look, look at wife number two, maybe. Yo, these wives all hate each other, bro. Of course they would. The main one acts like this. Look at this. She fucks up. She's like, <laughs> God, I'm dumbass. Dumbass. In private. Yo, that's smirk. That's smirk for the second wife. <laughs> Only Flora is with Huguenot? Why? It's Flora Beltram! Christina Beltram, king and queen! And, and, and then Stuart and the blonde shitty guy? They're Huguenots who are just high nobles. Yet they were overlaid with the royal family in that one frame, which makes it so confusing. Why would they do that? Yeah. Wow, never seen her. This is weird to see Christina like this. Because all I've seen from Christina is her being a bitch in episode one. But in episode 1, she was already hanging out with Seria, so I'm sure they were always close. And we've only seen her act towards us, just being cold and silent. So obviously, in private, with the friends, she's gonna act like this. Yeah, I do believe the royal family, the Beltrams in the past, were alliance with the Huguenot faction, and that's why Stuart and them were in the same picture. But Arbor family also was, you know, trying to compete for the power, and now they've taken over. Huguenots have fled, and the royal family... Then have they also fled because Christina has visited? I'm not too sure about that part. Royal family is under house arrest? Hmm. But Christina's just allowed to show up like this? That's very weird. But the Huguenots have basically left. And Christina, royal family, Beltram's house arrest, Arbor family kind of like running shit here because of the peace treaty that they were able to kind of make against the proxy empire because race is just basically puppeteering that shitty Charles guy. Skill issue. Where's Flora at? Do you not fled the kingdom with Flora? You can just do that? I guess the Beltram, like, they sold off Flora to the Duke. Because, like, Royalty and strong nobility, alliance, here have Flora as like a sign of like respect, I don't know, and that's why Flora was also just left. You were forced the hand. But she would only smile at Rio. I didn't know Christina was like that. Wedding crash, wedding crash. Okay, looking like Christina might clutch during the wedding crash. Okay. I have a feeling Flora is also just someone that we need to save right now later on. Flora arc will be probably in the future after we save Sedia because the Huguenots, right? They're shit. They're absolute trash. They got Stuart in them. So Rio will probably save Flora somehow again. And Flora will still have a debt that she could never pay us back and we'll just ghost her. Ah, so. Alfred. 
お前は華やかに人体教の戦士王の剣と呼ばれるほどの腕前なのだからな the だがザタシにある、okay. お前は私の命令にした Security is under his authority So I'm sure when the crash happened everyone can just blame Charles Because he's the one that set up the, you know, security here, bro. Do you want to do it? Sure. Ha! 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 Damn, look at these, dude. They got like five. No, they have like six important horse riding knights surrounding the carrots. They have like what? Two by six, so 12 mage people and even more people behind. But none of this shit matters to us, man. <laughs> Silver Bride! Bantai! 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 <laughs> Fuck this kingdom. Fuck House Arbor. I hate them all. I wish we could just destroy this kingdom. I wish we were the demon lords in this show. Unfortunately, I don't think a demon lord really exists in this show. The demons are basically the nobles here. The demons are Charles. They showed up. They pulled up. I don't know who the one on the far right is. I've never met her before. Because, you know, it's usually Flora and Christina with the king and the queen. The blue hair girl. New character? Never seen her before. The guards? The guards? A race? A race planning something? Surely a race, like... What is race's incentive here? To ensure that this kingdom of Beltrum will simply just exist crippled under this peace negotiation and just to be just, you know, be a good boy and stay put. It's not in race's best interest to, you know, destroy the kingdom right now. Well, he could just destroy it. I'm not sure if he's capable, but like, grazing the kingdom, I'm sure, would also work. But he probably wants this place as like a puppet, right? Because he can just completely control Charles, so he probably won't do anything. We'll simply observe. That's the end. Not yet? Not yet? Haruto, Haruto. Wait, we're not over yet. She's in spirit form right now. Banzai! Okay, what's your plan, Aisha? Uh oh, here we go. Communicate. Real. I'm here. Yo. So, to break you out of here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> It's because I have to get married to your dumbass Charles. Why wouldn't I be crying? No. <laughs> I feel like he's trying to be genuine right now too. But by the tone of his voice and his, you know, look in the face. Oh, I didn't really care for me like that. Wow. I'm, oh man. Oh brother. Bro has no clue. <laughs> Rio's gone. What will Rio do? Aisha's gone too. Yo, the episode's still going! It's still going! Oh! That's your plan? <laughs> to just run it down mid? <laughs> I thought he would like swoop in and take her and like, you know, use the fucking instant transmission teleport device that we got and just go somewhere else.
You're just running down mid right now? <laughs> Wait, 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 I'm, let him cook. Let let him cook. I, I I'm sure I'm sure he has a plan. Okay, that is today's episode of Spirit Chronicles. Today's episode was obviously all the setup, right, leading up to the day of the wedding. The politics right now was very confusing because of my misassumption of who the royal family's last name is and the faction of Huguenot. But royal family Beltram, you know, Arbor family Charles. They were able to, you know. You, uh, uh, submit under like a peace treaty against the proxy empire because the race is obviously controlling Charles. Huguenot that was backing Beltram have all left. Flora has left with the Huguenots because Flora is probably offered by the Beltram royal families for their you know allegiance to them. And the Beltram family they're just kind of cucked right now and under house arrest. Christina, this is a side of her I never saw. But if you think about Christina's relationship with Sedia, it's a very favorable one, so it's it's not a surprise. Charles is a piece of shit. Oh my god, I can't wait till he gets what he's coming for him. And wonder what Race is thinking. Because it's probably in his best interest to keep this puppet state going under his control. I don't think it's in his best interest to just like destroy this place. Nor to kind of stop the wedding. Wonder if he'll con like confront Rio. And the other guards, you know, Alfred and them. Wonder if they will oppose Rio. Probably because they have to be, you know, loyal right now. This... This whole politics in Beltrum fucking sucks. I really hate this kingdom. Most of the places suck. The only good places has been the wilderness and Yagumo. And even then, some of the villages in Yagumo seem to suck. But next episode, it's coming, bro. And we're going to watch that shit right away. That's it from me. If you're still here, though, and if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. Until next time, take care.